Today, I'm going to be beating UCN's 50-20 mode. I have played this game in the past before, however, because of my absence, I had to relearn every little detail with this game. A lot of you guys were letting me know that I should finally beat UCN's 50-20 mode and make a video out of it, so I decided to start a journey, a four-day journey as a matter of fact, to see if I could even beat UCN's 50-20 mode. And here's how it all went. Day one went, well, as good as you might expect. Nice. I suck at this game. What I was trying to do was gradually relearn the mechanics of each and every animatronic by doing the challenges. However, I felt like that was just messing me up even more. And so, because of that, I decided to take matters into my own hands. What I ended up doing was I tried to regain some of that muscle memory by gradually upping the stakes a little bit. Granted, it did take me a couple of tries, however, I was still in that learning stage, I was still I was still in those baby steps, if you will. But because of the strategy that I decided to put in place, I ended up doing this. Oh, no, not now. Here we go, chat. Here we go. Nice. I immediately jumped from 1,000 points all the way to 5,100. And that's just the beginning. I did it again, jumping all the way to 7,200. Clearly, I'm making some really good progress. But clearly, my past self didn't know this. It's not gonna last long. I was then going for the 8,000 point value to see if I could beat that too. And well, it was bad. Just take me, just take me. I knew what I did. I did something wrong. I knew it. As soon as, soon as that popped off, man. That sucks, bro. Ah! Fair, dude, it wasn't fair. So yeah, I decided to take a break from this stream and push it over to the next stream. I mean, we made some tremendous progress starting out and I'm hoping that the next stream works out even better. Day two started out very wholesome as one of my viewers ended up sending me a little gift. I really don't care what anybody else says. I love Attack on Titan. Huge thank you to the soul of Cinder for sending me this. Anyways, guys, back on topic. So for this stream, I wanted to start off with the 7,800 point value and kind of just inch my way up all the way to the 10,000 point value. It did end up taking me a couple of tries, but I was a committed person and I didn't want to give up so easily, so I just kept going. But this is what I ended up having for my roster. I wanted to save the music animatronics for last, or very much last. Uh, as for Rockstar Bonnie, I, I, I didn't even want to deal with them at that time. I, I really didn't. And I mean, the same thing goes with Foxy, Toy Freddy, and of course, Funtime Foxy, because that's going to be a whole bundle of joy. And for Nightmare BB, I I really don't know why I didn't choose him early on. I mean, he's a very easy animatronic to deal with, to be honest with you. Anyways, after the 32 attempts, we got it. Let's go, chap. Woo! New high score, let's go! After watching the stupidly annoying Chica high school video, I wanted to up the stakes even more from the 7800 value all the way to 8400. And surprisingly, I got it on my first try. I I'm not just the goat or something, like what's going on? Nah, just kidding. The real reason is because of the amount of hydrates that I was getting throughout these streams. It is absolutely insane. Not sponsored, by the way. I think the biggest oopsie that I made was I accidentally let Mangle in at around 3 a.m. Early 3 a.m., mind you. And he did absolutely nothing to me. Just stood there. That's all. That's it. No, no biggie. No big D. And on the exact same stream, after around three attempts, I was able to get my very first perfect score at 8,600. And now let me show you how that all went. Ooh, that could have been bad. Thank you for depositing five coins. <laughs> 
Please deposit five coins. Please deposit five coins. Please deposit. Thank you for depositing five coins. And done. Woo! Three. Three high scores in a row. We're making tremendous progress. At this point, today is Saturday, and you know what that means. It means kids are not in school, I'm not working, and so the grind continues. And this was going to be a much longer grind. And today it's going to be a much bigger grind because I'm going to be learning how to deal with the marionette as well as Chica. Or if you guys don't know, you have to use the global music box in order to keep the marionette as well as Chica dormant. It also it goes the same with Lefty as well, but it's not as big of a deal. Just for a bit of a 101, you have to use the global music box every 15 seconds and then switch back to the generator as well as the fan. And that is a lot easier said than done. Because there's a lot of things that are going on in the game anyways, just trying to have the thought process of switching to the global music box and then back to the fan is incredible incredibly difficult. Like seriously, I lost track on the amount of times that I died trying to get the 9400 point value. It is insane how difficult this actually gets. And I mean, I haven't even started with Foxy, Toy Freddy, or even Funtime Foxy for that matter, so I knew for a fact that this was going to take a lot longer than I initially thought. As a matter of fact, for my Saturday stream, I was streaming for a good four hours and I didn't get a high score even once. The closest I ended up getting was a 4 a.m. at 3.23 before getting jump scared by Chica, so I was pretty drained at this point. However, that'll change when I got some help from Misforce. This guy, this guy, definitely go check him out. He's, he's a really good YouTuber. He really wants to make it as a YouTuber. So de definitely go check him out. Give him a sub. At this point going forward, I decided that it would have been a better, decided it would have been better if I was just recording the gameplay. That way I had all of my files right on my computer right then and there, and I could just edit them and get all of this chaos over with. So here's the strategy we had in place. I was really struggling with the global music box and I just, I couldn't, I just couldn't do it on my own, and so I got Misforce to tell me when to switch between the Global Music Box and the Gen and Fan. So enjoy watching me finally beating 4720. good switch um yeah i'm a, a little off okay switch Yeah. 
it. Thank you for depositing five coins. Which... Oh shoot. That was a close one. Nice! Oh my gosh, dude! Oh my gosh! I'm in so much pain, bro. At this point, I was extremely ecstatic because this was the furthest that I've ever gotten in this game. But then I had this sudden realization. There was just one more thing in my way. Again, thank you so much to Miss Force for helping me out with this. But now, it's time to finish this. After a collected day of watching a bunch of tutorials on how to beat 50-20 mode and doing a bunch of practices like uh, coin farming and stuff like that, which by the way looks something like this. I forgot to hit record. All of this grinding since day one has finally come to this moment. And ladies and gentlemen, we finally got it. Please enjoy.
Finally, two weeks, two weeks this took. Never once did I think that I was actually going to get through this challenge. And it wasn't just for me, it was from you guys, the viewers, the ones that are, are, have always been there since day one to come out and support me. And I can't thank you guys enough for that. You guys mean the absolute world to me. And because of you, I was able to make an achievement that I've been dreaming to hit for the longest time ever. So thank you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, be sure to leave a like, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next streams, in the next video. Peace out.